Member statements. The member from Halton. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to remember and honour those who risk their lives to protect all of us. On November 11, Canadians across the country will pause together and pay tribute to the brave men and women who have made the ultimate sacrifice in the service of our country. It's a time to think about the extraordinary courage and dedication of those who have served in our armed forces. In my family, we will be thinking about Clifford, Richard and Gordon Kimmel, three sons who displayed extraordinary courage and dedication but lost their lives in the Second World War. We will also pause to think about great-grandma Kimmel, the mother of the three boys, who never got to see her sons return home after the war. Grandma Kimmel was eventually named the Silver Cross Mother in 1961, following the deaths of her three sons. Here is their story. Rifleman Gordon Leroy Kimmel of the Royal Winnipeg Rifles was killed on June 8, 1944, in the Normandy invasion. He was 28. Lance Sergeant Richard Kenneth Kimmel was with the Rif Regina Rifle Regiment. Richard died on June 18, 1944, while taking part in the Normandy invasion. He was also 28. Finally, Corporal C Clifford Howard Kimmel was with the Hastings and Prince Edward Regiment. He was the youngest of the Kimmel boys and passed away on December 15, 1944, at the age of 26. All three of the Kimmel boys who lost their lives were decorated with various medals. The loss of our three great uncles during the Second World War devastated the family. Stories about them are told over and over again every Remembrance Day. This November 11th, my family will take a moment to give silent thanks for all of our courageous men and women, past and present, who have fought and died protecting our country. Thank you. Thank you.